What's going on guys? In this video, Adam and Andrew are going to teach you how to write a research paper. If this helps, make sure to leave a comment and a like down below. Enjoy. Step 1. Choose your topic. Choice. It's the best part of being a real human. Just like choosing where you eat sushi will decide the rest of your day, choosing your topic will decide the fate of the rest of your research paper. Choose wisely. A few moments later. Step 2. Getting Sources Just like choosing your drug dealer, you need someone reliable for your sources. Some unreliable sources may not have the correct information on a topic or allow anyone to edit them. <coughs> Wikipedia. Step 3. Note taking. Just like writing down all the girls' phone numbers you get at a party, you'll need to write down important information from your sources. The more information, the better. But be careful as to only highlight relevant information. A few moments later. Step 4. Writing an outline. Just like planning your vacation to Fiji, you need to carefully map out how your research paper is going to be laid before you. Make sure to make it nice and neat, or it may be hard to understand. Ah, yeah. Just you know why. Step 5. Thesis Statement A thesis statement briefly covers everything you're going over in your research paper. It glues together all the elements of your paper into one sentence. Step 6. Direct Quote Just like quoting your favorite spaghetti western starring Clint Eastwood, you need to put in quotes from your sources to make your paper sound awesome and legitimate. However, you can't have a quote that takes up more than two lines of space. Step 7. In-text citations. In-text citations are a very serious deal. After every direct quote, you must give credit to the author. If you do not do this, you are plagiarizing, which is illegal. Step 8. Draft Writing. The time has finally come to fight the final fight. You're taking everything you've gathered and putting it into five paragraphs. There are three parts. The introduction, the body, and the conclusion. The introduction. The introduction consists of one paragraph that includes your thesis statement. The main point of the introduction is to grasp the reader's attention. The narrator is taking over our lives! He's making us do what he wants! Wow, he's gonna really grasp my attention. Let's go! The body. 
The body consists of three paragraphs that contain your direct quotes and citations. You're taking all of your research and applying it into your paper. The Conclusion The conclusion sums up everything that your body stated and restates the thesis statement. You should leave the reader with something to think about. When you finish writing your conclusion, you should then proceed to formatting and checking everything you've written. All right, Adam, this is it. We're gonna get the narrator. You ready? Yes! Work cited. Your work cited page appears after the last page of your research paper. It states where you found your sources in corresponding order. At this point, you are finished with your research paper, and without further ado, I take my leave. When I passed you on in the doorway, well, you took me with a glance. She looked to the death zone. But I asked to put down Now you go stand to the pictures I always get chocolate stains in my Father's going crazy. 